Hi everyone. Welcome to California. You're watching Indian cooking with Suganti. In this video, I'm going to talk about the benefits of sprouted fenugreek and green grams. And also I'm going to show you how I prepare the sprouts. And I will also show you how many yummy uh, salads you can make with this. The fenugreek sprouts have more health benefits than the seeds. Fenugreek sprouts are high in antioxidants and it also lowers bad cholesterol, maintains healthy testosterone levels in men and improves milk flow in nursing mothers, helps control diabetes, helps with digestive issues, high in fiber content, which helps uh, detoxification of the intestines. It is also um, antiviral and uh, anti-inflammatory and it reduces inflammation in the body. It also reduces acne on the face and skin irritation it, and it's also very good for hair growth. When you consume the fenugreek sprouts, what happens it goes in the intestine and it creates like a slimy layer and thus reducing the absorption of blood sugar and fat and that's how it reduces the cholesterol and uh, um, blood sugar in your body and that's how it helps with the weight loss also. Keeping your intestine clean by detoxifying it more often will result in clear skin and also it will protect you from a lot of health issues. Consuming sprouted fenugreek has 40% more health benefits than eating the dried ones and the soaked ones because the sprouted fenugreek has the highest level of antioxidants that's because the presence of flavonoids and uh, polyphenols found in sprouted fenugreeks what are these flavonoids and polyphenols flavonoids are compounds found in plant foods that are studied for their role in preventing cancers as well as other chronic diseases and also it has high content of antioxidants. Polyphenols also compounds found in plant-based foods. They are packed with antioxidants and has potential health benefits. And um, polyphenols can improve and help with the digestion issues and weight management difficulties, diabetes, neurodegenerative diseases and cardiovascular diseases. So let's see what it does for women. I mentioned earlier it increases the breast milk in nursing women and another thing it does is it um, increases the contraction in the uteruses. That means it's not good for pregnant women or women who are trying to get pregnant. They say fenugreek triggers breast growth in two ways by mimicking the effect of estrogen and by stimulating the production of prolactin. Both of these hormones are crucial to the development of the breasts. So you may say fenugreek is the safe and the natural way of breast enlargement. We Indians, we've been using this fenugreek seed in our cooking for thousands of years because our forefathers knew the benefits of this. The current generation is um, just now trying to understand all the benefits of this spice. All the benefits mentioned here are not clinically proven but uh, derived from traditional use. Finally, fenugreek does help with hair growth. When I was growing up in India, I always used the hair oil made by my mother. She used to boil the coconut oil with fenugreek seeds and hibiscus flowers and uh, curry leaves and um, henna leaves. And I used to have real healthy long and thick hair. Next, let's look at the benefits of mung bean sprouts or green gram sprouts. Mung bean sprouts are rich in antioxidants and high in fiber. It regulates blood sugar and thus helps with diabetes and lowers cholesterol, 
and the absorption of fat. And that's how it helps with weight loss. And it also reduces the risk of cardiovascular diseases. Next, let's see how I make my sprouts. I combine both the seeds, the green grams and the fenugreek, and I sprout them together. And I found it easier that way. Green mung beans in Tamil Pasi Parappar. And this is fenugreek seeds. In Hindi, methi seeds in Tamil Vendayam. The fenugreek seeds are usually very bitter, but if you sprout them, the bitterness goes away. Actually, the sprouted fenugreeks are very tasty. They are a bit creamy and uh, with slight sweetness to it. I use one cup of green beans, pasi parpa or mung beans, half a cup of fenugreek seeds. This is what I use, one and a half proportion but your proportion can be any way you like next wash the seeds really well until the water runs clean and clear add water and uh, put it aside and let it soak for a day or two some people soak it for less than a day this is the next day you can see the water is fully absorbed I add a little bit more water this is the end of the second day. The seeds are already starting to sprout. Let me show you. Look at this, the tiny sprout, it's coming out. Take a clean cloth and spread it um, inside a bowl and pour the soaked seeds into it. Make a bundle and tie it loosely with a rubber band or a thin cloth. Keep the bundle away from direct sunlight. Just keep it in the room temperature. And uh, keep sprinkling water if the cloth is dry. It should be nice and wet all through. So every day you have to check it. This is the second day. The bundle was a little bit dry so I sprinkled some water. Do you see the color of the cloth? It's turning yellowish brown. Uh, it's because of the fenugreek seeds. Nothing is wrong with that. This is the third day. So let's open the bundle and see how the seeds have germinated, sprouted. For fenugreek seeds, I do not want to keep it more than three days. The sprout should be less than one centimeter long. That's when it has the most benefits both bean and the fenugreek seeds have sprouted beautifully. Like I had mentioned earlier, the sprouted uh, fenugreek has 40% more health benefits than the dried ones or the soaked ones. Let's see how you can consume the sprouts. You can either have it just, just like that, without adding anything, just plain uh, sprouts, or you can make yummy salads with that. You can be creative, you can add anything um, you want greens fruits nuts anything you want you can add it and then come up with some salad these are some of the salads I make this is like a salsa kind green chili cilantro tomato and a cucumber and avocado and this is um, my favorite fruits and greens and this is a sauteed stir-fried sprouts with turmeric uh, cilantro and the chili don't cook this for too long just a minute or two should be fine this one is my green salad with lots of greens and blueberries and uh, avocados and uh, this is also my favorite. I make the sprouts every five days so that I will always have enough uh, supplies in my fridge for my salads. If you haven't subscribed to my channel Indian Cooking with Suganti, please subscribe and click the bell button. Please share the video with your friends and family. I will be back soon with more healthy and delicious um, recipes and uh, interesting videos. Until then, take care and thank you for watching.